guys, my name is Jody, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. But if you're not, then welcome back. In this video, I feel really like in the Christmas spirit. Yeah, do da, do da. I have problems. I'm sorry. Anyway, let's move on. In this video, I want to show you guys the Fab Fit Fun, uh, the Fab Fit Fun mini box I received with my yearly. No, with my yearly. No, with my um seasonal box that's what i meant to say my seasonal box funny thing is i got the mini and the seasonal hasn't gotten here yet so i will be unboxing the seasonal like the winter one very very soon but for now we're gonna dive on into the mini because i really want to see what i got before we move on i want to shout out uni wigs if you don't know now you know this here is a wig guys oh my god so instead of like full-on hair extensions i actually have a wig on and i don't even know how to act right now because I'm actually digging it. But look, I was able to like pull my edges back. You see these here are my edges. I was able to hide like the edge of the wig with my hair. I think it looks really good. I'm so excited because this is going to make like bad hair days so much easier because I don't have to worry about blending in my short hair with my extensions anymore. I'm so excited. Let's move on to the little unboxing. I want to show you guys everything that I got in these bags. I like the style of the box too, like you see, like it says. Greetings from Los Angeles, California. Feel good, do good, discovery happy. So um, what had happened was I had a yearly subscription so that uh, all four boxes for the year could be paid in advance, but um, I forgot to like automatically renew it or whatever the case was. So I had to resubscribe, which is why I'm getting my box like super late this time around, but whatever. So when I resubscribed, I ended up being able to snag a mini box. This was a promotion that they had going on and they usually have promotions throughout like the seasons. So that's something you want to check out. It says that this box has a retail value of 162 dollars, dollars. The first item is this one over here. It is the Moroccan Gold Series. Lip, 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 even with my glasses. Oh my God. I always say I need to wear my glasses cause I can't really like read properly. I have astigmatism and I feel like the words, like the letters as I'm trying to read them are bouncing at me. So, um, but even with my glasses, I had a moment. Leave in mask. It is an intense care for all hair types. I thought it was an oil. I would have applied this on my hair. I do want to smell it though. Oh, I'm glad I didn't even try to spray this right now. It smells good. Oh, this smells really good. Oh, wow. Generally when I get like uh, leave in masks, deep conditioners, that kind of thing, I set to the side and I use it specifically on Ty's hair because my hair is pretty hydrated, very like pin straight um, when it's not crazy. So I don't really have issues with my hair, but I love using products such as this one for Ty's hair. However, this smells so good. I'm going to keep it for myself. The next product in here is the Grown Alchemist Hydro Repair Day Cream, Camellia Geranium Blossom. This is for the hair, for the face, the hands. This here is for the skin. I do have by this brand and I got it in a fab fit fun as well. I feel like I do have their exfoliator. It's in my shower right now, but it's really good. I want to smell you. I smell everything. Someone was like, I love how you smell everything. I feel like I'm smelling it with you. <laughs> I do. I smell everything and I try to give you the best description possible. What you smell like? It's a lightly perfumey type of scent. It smells like skincare. It's not like that serious. It's not great. It's not bad. It's, it's, it smells like skincare. Okay. 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 And then the next item in here, which I know what it smells like, cause I could smell it when I opened up the box is a sponge gel, a black orchid body wash infused buffer and er, oh my God guys, this here. Oh, if they had a perfume that smelled like this, I would like pay for it. Like I would actually like pay whatever. It doesn't matter. It smells that good. Ugh, if there was only some smell of vision, I swear. I'm into scents. Like I feel like everything should be scented. I know that uh, that's unrealistic, but I that's how I feel. Oh my God, you guys have no idea. Oh. I'm keeping this as well. The ones that I've received in the past, I've wanted to use. And then I have given some of them to Ty. This one's mine. And then the last product in this box is this Yumi Kim. Uh, I want to say this is like a makeup travel bag. So the design isn't exactly me. I'm going to say that the, the design is not exactly me. 
I feel like I'm not a very florally person, but it's nice to get in the box. I wonder how much this goes for like retail value. Let's see, when you open it up, Okay, so it's like a little toiletry thing. Okay, so we'll definitely get some use out of this. Um, we're planning our next vacation. I don't know exactly where I'm going, but I know I'm going somewhere. So uh, the idea behind having something like this, and then it has like a little clip so you can hang this behind the door, kind of works for me. So we'll definitely get use out of it. I just kind of wish it was more like of a neutral something, like marbly, maybe just a solid color. But I think these go for a really high price. Although I don't know why, maybe it's just the brand. Um, but I know these are highly priced because I've seen them at, as add-ons. They had like this size, a bigger one, a bigger one. They had different print and it was like up there in price. All right, in this mini box, I ended up getting these four full size products and apparently it has a total retail value of $162. This box, I paid nothing for. When I say nothing, I mean nothing. Now, I feel like this is one of those starter boxes. So when you refer people, they may get these items in the box. That's what I feel like. I'm not 100% sure, but this resembles a starter box to me. So let's go through prices. The Yumi Kim, which is this over here, is $58. Again, feeling the fabric and everything, I think the hardware feels great. It doesn't feel cheap, but I don't see why it would be $58 unless it is like an expensive brand. Then the Grown Alchemist Hydra Repair Day Cream Camellia Geranium Blossom retails for $49, but that's expected. It's Grown Alchemist. The sponge gel is $16, and I love this. Oh my God, I love it, love it, love it, love it. And then the Moroccan Gold Series Leave-In Mask is $39. It smells amazing. I don't know that I would replace that when it's over because it's $39, guys. It smells good. Honestly, like I'm really happy with the items in here because four items, $162. And to be quite frank, I paid nothing. Even if this was a starter box, starter boxes go for $5 as long as you get an invitation. If you get an invite via email, you pay $5 for shipping. You get the starter box for free, which I really like the whole concept of. But I feel like this is a terrific starter box. So I think this is a starter box. It's a mini, but it's a starter box, in my opinion. Anyway, talking about starter boxes, I do have a few starter boxes that I can give away. The starter boxes are free as long as you get an invite and you're only gonna pay $5 for shipping. I do have, like I said, a few starter boxes. So let me know down below in the comment section whether or not you're interested in a starter box. That way I can choose the first few people that uh, leave the comment, first come, first serve. Also, if you have starter boxes, I know a whole bunch of you guys have starter boxes available if you have any starter boxes available make sure you uh, check down below in the comment section for anyone that actually is interested feel free to just go ahead and share um, your starter boxes with them just make sure if you're sending them an invite comment to them and let them know I'm sending you an invite that way anyone else that's looking for people to send invites to know not to send it to that person because that person's supposed to get one from you yay okay so uh that is a wrap for this video again make sure you comment down below if you're interested in a starter box and yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed it if you've enjoyed this video stay till the end screens I am suggesting a few other videos I think you guys would enjoy as well thank you so much for spending a few minutes out of your day with me and I'll see you guys very very soon Bye, guys.